but I am ready. I'm ready to get oil underway once again. We are connected. So first off, I'm just going to get rid of this base that's right here. Shoot. Didn't mean to do that, but oh well. Okay, I'm going to get rid of this base just to relieve some pressure on us. Oh. We have 18 grenades. Keep doing this. Keep uh, making those and forgetting about it. Uh oh. We have our first big spitter. That. Ooh boy, that is dangerous. <laughs> that doesn't look good at all. Did a ton of damage to us pretty quickly. Save over that. Okay, let's aggro this group. Where did the big spitter go? Shoot. <laughs> Killed myself again. These guys are strong. There it is. Wise, we're starting to get in trouble here. We'll start aggroing these guys, and this will become more of an issue very soon. Looks like we're already aggroing them. Check out this base, see how big it is, and see if we can handle it. If we can, we should. I run out of ammo, I need to remember to grab it from our church. Thanks. I think I think I'm just basically killing myself with the ammo or with the grenades. I think that's what's happening here. Because I'm not really sure what the big burst is otherwise. Alright, a couple more times. Let's... Oh. I want to aggro those guys. Yeah. <laughs> fine, it's fine. Slows are real. Oh, 
out of nades. Killed myself again. Uh, well, I died to a biter, but... Oh. Hi. Okay, let's try that again. You know what? I think we're fine. I'll just leave them, leave them be for now. Uh, they are gonna be an issue, but I'm too low on grenades to to do this right now. Much of a hassle. We're probably better off spending our time here after we have our oil set up. That way, we'll have something to come back to. Okay, so walls are going down. And put a bunch of turrets up. They seem to attack over here, so I think this is a fine place to put these up. These guys and hopefully that will hold for now. Let's get this going. We're gonna do the same type of setup that we did before. Basically gonna bring these over here and do that. Don't need to be fancy. Okay, so we're going to bring it across. Let's bring it up a little bit. So this is going to be where my walkway is, and everything else is going to be where we put uh, our other stuff. Oh, I never made more of these. Well, okay. I'm wasting land here, but it's okay. <laughs> oh no. I can't control Z that one. Darn it. Well, I'll be okay. Sorry guys. <laughs> we'll have to live with that mistake for the rest of the map. Hoping the oh we're out of landfills. Okay. Well we can test it out. Is this enough space for one of these? It is. Nice. Oh this is okay. Perfect. Okay, 
right, let's go get more stone and landfills. We're almost there. How are we doing here? We got green signs, we got red signs. All as well. All right. Sometimes I can make through there, sometimes I can't. I don't know what the deal is there. I passed the stone, which is where we wanted to be. Plop down on this. Hopefully this will be enough. Solar energy is done, that's good. Get our accumulators going. So how many do we have now? We have 67, I think that's more than enough. I'm going to keep making them, because we, we can. Alright, big biters are here. So I think it's about time we revamped this setup here. We need to space them out a little bit more and add a couple more turrets to the side, I guess. So we're gonna need more turrets very soon. Probably go and make those. Bar. I don't like that. really don't like that. Where, where did you guys come from? Alright, we're going to reload from... <laughs> kind of far back, but they must have come from up top here. to hope that's going to be good enough for us. No idea why they came down to here. Hey, well, we have our, we can redeem ourselves on, on this at least. Okay, we're gonna go ahead up and make that stone again, and then, uh, 
we can redo this turret patch again. We might want to stop making this and switch over to just making turrets or something. Wait a second, I'm going to turn on the fan. It's a little hot in the room. Okay, so we're gonna make uh, our stone. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put down a couple more this time. That way we can do this a little bit faster. I'm going to place down our uh, patented gear assembly machine making area. And we'll use this for our turrets that we're going to make in a second. Let's revamp this. And I want to do get over back to our oil sometime soon because I don't really have faith in the turrets over there to fend back anything other than a preliminary push. Fine for now. You guys doing? Doing fine. Go pick up our turrets and a bit more ammo. Go head over to our oil. This is looking promising. Oh, oh. Okay. That should help them out. Make them come right here. 
At least that's the plan. Kind of want to check on those as well, so we'll go do that on our way down. Fifteen gun turrets. Up a little bit more copper. We have the coal in our inventory, as well as the stuff. damage on any of these guys at all. That is wonderful. Another go down here. The pre pre precautionary measure. We never made more big electric bulls. Hopefully this will be fine. Have some visitors here. Placing these down, moving it over. This next set. And it just so happens that this is a decent length for every other one. You can just put down a big pole and you'll be good to go. Oh, that's it. Go. And bring some power over and we're business. Achieved. Have these guys. Put a couple more turrets down here. Play this will take care of any problems that come.
Alright. So we're gonna have to leave it at that. Uh, we might want to go and take out those bases up there. But let's do that after we get our rest of our oil underway here. Let's save. All right. So I don't think I'm going to be putting my power down here if I do need more power. Uh, we're going to start swinging it on the other side if we need it. Let's take those away. Up here. I don't want them in my inventory. I didn't put them in the right spot, but that's fine. And the reason uh, we're doing the right one, because that's where our uh, where it has to be when we're using the advanced filtration method water is going to be on the left side so we are planning for the future on that one and hopefully that will be soon all right we didn't use any pipes That's a fun interruption for you. What happened? Entering site access for an engineer to place real hardware this afternoon. Oh. It looks like we're good to go here. Yeah. You're you're Are you on site? Is it Thursday for you right now? It's Thursday for you right now, isn't it? I was thinking you were on site right now, but that didn't make sense. Okay. are dying. What's happening? Uh oh. Oh yeah, I never built that out, did I? Let's go add our turrets there. Give us some ammo. We might want to up our production of armor piercing rounds uh, and just add one to each group just to help us out a little bit. Why is this here? <laughs> That's slightly concerning. Didn't have enough ammo. Well, that sounds annoying. So this is all of our remaining ammo 
<laughs> I am starting to be a little afraid, but I think we still have this under control. We'll have to keep an eye out. Yeah, it's, it's still annoying to have to get up and go out. You're not expecting to, at least. Okay, so... I have some piercing rounds to work with if we need to. Hey, Scorpion Green, how's it going? Be on overtime? Like you're not... You'd be off duty at that point. So yeah, that's pretty annoying. Weekend. That is coming up. For, for some reason, I, I before you said that, I was still feeling like it's the beginning of the week. It's been a long week for me, so uh, I guess that's good. I'm ready for the weekend as well. These guys are dying. I'm going to not put as much ammo in them. Five thirty. That's pretty crazy. And oh, yeah, I gotcha. That sucks. Is there no one else on site for to do any of that? That's p the potentials will be terrible <laughs> since I'm quote unquote multitasking this setup here, but hopefully it will turn out fine. I'm hoping I left enough room here. I'm starting to think I might not have. We will find out. Oh, so you, you have duty of going since you're the closest. Gotcha. That sucks. That's fine. I need to put a radar down there. But 9.30 on Monday? That sounds nice. There's, there's something in there after all. Better than absolutely nothing. <laughs> Okay, looks like we have enough pipes for this. Oops.
Darn, autosave messed up my time in there. I've been tinkering with sound delay again. I have not. Is it? Is it off again? I've left it off. Lagging on visual. Hopefully, it's better now. Thanks for letting me know. Okay, so let's see how we're gonna do this. Last time I had petroleum on the outside. Um, I have heavy oil, and I did that because of this setup here. I had to do it that way. Didn't really change anything. We do have enough room to work with. So this. And we're going to do the same idea, bringing plastic here. Uh, we'll bring light oil up here and then heavy oils down here. Oh, thank you. Much appreciated. I hard for me to tell if that's ever a problem since I the only time I look at the stream afterwards is going to be uh, when I edit, and I probably won't notice then either. Let's see. Light oil goes there. And I'll put our heavy oil. Could put it right here. Uh, it better would be right here, actually. So I'll do that. And crack heavy to light right here, uh, put our any lubricant right here, and then light to petroleum somewhere in between. Uh, I probably shouldn't put it this, I probably should put light oil here, heavy oil here, now that I'm thinking about it. I think I can still salvage that, so let's do that. I'll just slowly move it over. Am I, am I losing it? I can't tell. I think I think we're fine. that. Let's move our FOL right here. And there we go. So we finally have everything that we need. Uh, should be not full on oil yet. Now we just need to get our plastics online, and let me get our lubricant online as well. I'm gonna put lubricant right here. Uh, 
since I don't see any other reason to put it anywhere else. Trying to put it closer to this area as we can, but uh, it's fine if it's not that close. We can always bring it over some other way. An extra light oil could go to the twin turrets guarding the walls. Alright. Hmm. We'll have to consider doing that. Uh, I'll need to figure out how I want to bring that over. Yeah. <laughs> Naturally. Naturally. Can't be too easy on you. Yeah, I I will work on I'll see what I can do there. We should probably set up flamethrower turrets soon though. Um or something. We need to do something because of the big biters are uh are out, so they're going to start overrunning us eventually. Uh presumably. So I wanna make sure that we're on top of things here. Refill all of our things. It does look like uh, we have them under control for now. I haven't heard too many of our turrets dying yet, so that is something good so far. I guess we have not been researching for a while. I completely forgot about that. This should have been done a long time ago. It wasn't that much. Go pick up more things to bring over there. I need to remember I just put my inventory down there. overdid it there. Didn't probably need to. But I'm a little surprised we only had that much iron. It looks like red science was our culprit. So we might actually, we might want to move this. Um, I think we do want to move it, but I'm not sure where we'd put it at this point. We have room over here. We have all this to play with. Um, it, it's just, it's a little janky, but I'd really love to fill this in. I'm not sure we have the stone for it though. <laughs> what are you doing here? So hell. It's it's going. It's going. When are we playing Factorio, man?
All right, so I want to fill this in. And then if we can fill this in, then we can use up this area for any of our research or anything like that. Always room for improvement. <laughs> of course. A radar over there. But they're only destroying walls, so that's good. Uh... Kind of want to do this. I think we have enough military science for that. And I do think it'd be worth the upgrade over any of this stuff. Because this will help us stay afloat a little bit longer. Has been nuts. I gotcha. Yeah, we've been doing fun, having lots of uh, death and destruction in this death world. So, been entertaining for me at least. <laughs> Let's see. Let's make sure that these guys are have their ammo. Looks like they did not. More turrets on us. Again, I don't want to put this on a corner because then all the focus fire is going to be on there and I don't want that to happen. Let's go pick up our inventory. Our iron isn't looking too hot. But it's not looking that bad either. Uh, we have a lot stored up from before because we didn't we weren't utilizing all the iron that we have we're making we have almost 200 landfills but I don't think that's even close enough to fill up this lake and come over here and heal up these guys is our vanguard for this area Need it to be healthy All right, let's see what we can do here. Uh, I guess even right here would be enough. I really want to get rid of this though. Just, I just need room to work with. And it's really unfortunate because we're running out of stone and this is not going to last us forever. As you can see, that was 200. So this is going to be another 200, another 200. So. Uh, a little, little scary. Check on our, our, um, bricks here. Everything is full. Why are you guys not backed up? <laughs> oh, this is not full. left uh all right i'll leave that going eventually this will back up and we'll have stone to work with so that that'll be okay i guess we need to stop running around doing nothing we need to get some work done so what do we need to do we have our products here we have not making plastics yet so we should do that so we need coal for that we have coal right here and again, we're going to be a little bit wary of using this coal because this is the coal for our power. And if we're going to steal all the coal from this, then we'd run out of power and that would be bad. So we got to just make sure that that doesn't happen. Uh, I don't want to set those up. I want to put plastic this way and bring it up that way. So. 
I guess we'll do something like this. We'll do four, four, uh, four buildings for now. That need to make more big electric poles. I've underutilized poles in the past. I need to get in the habit of using them better. All right, there we go. We have the underground uh, to use, so might as well use it. to waste an underground on, to get the plastic over, around it, but that's okay. Alright, so we have plastic now. That's something. Bring it straight across. About here is where I'm going to want to make our advanced circuits, so... I think this is a good spot and we'll just do as we usually do and put these into chests for now until we know what to do with them. Let's ch let's check out uh, how our other oil is doing and it looks like we didn't power up all those inserters so let's go do that. Okay, and we also want to make sulfur. That's also another uh, objective that we need to f fulfill here. Not put enough tanks here for light oil, so... That is why we're not have as much as I thought we would. It has been a long time and it doesn't look like we're stacking up on oil, so I guess these 10 refineries are going to be too much for our oil setup. Um, so this is going to be dry eventually, we'll have to keep an eye on that. So now that we have plastic, I'm going to pick up some and hand make some uh, red circuits. Do we have modular armor? we ever make that? Yeah, okay, we do. So I'm gonna go and see if I can make some modular armor, and then once I do that, uh, we can go and see if we can tackle some bases and kill some stuff. Then add iron. Check our pollution, and it's it hasn't really changed, which is good because uh, it's been on the edge this whole time. So I really want to get rid of these guys, all of these guys. If we can get rid of this, uh, our lives will be so much easier. Uh, additionally, if we can get rid of this, that'd be fantastic. We'll work on that once we get our modular armor. Unfortunately, we don't have any of the modules to put in the armor, but 
at least we'll have a little bit more defense to work with. Uh, what I also want to start working on is getting some solar panels made. That can c help cut us uh, cut down on pollution while still providing some energy for us. And we're also going to need that in the future, I think. Since I don't, I don't see uranium around us and adding more steam engines is not, not my favorite idea. Okay, let's put a let's put a radar down over there. Never mind, we don't have the capabilities to make it right now. Uh, coal-wise, we're doing are okay. Not fantastic, but not terrible either. Get all this fixed up, and then let's go see if we can kill, can kill some guys. This time we'll bring enough grenades with us to probably take care of them. We have almost 200 fish, so that seems decent. I don't think we'll run out of fish. Alright. Still doing good on copper. For whatever reason that still not full. Kinda of surprising to me. Got more ammo. And um circuits being made. Okay, I guess we'll head down and check over there. We'll put down some more turrets. Uh, overkill is better than not having enough, so let's do that. Let's go grab some more ammo. Grab all of our ammo. Kind of... That's way more than we had last time, but at the same time, this doesn't seem... enough. I might want to put more stone bricks down, but if I do that, then we won't be able to store up our stone. But probably the stone bricks are more important because, again, I'm told they absorb pollution. And the more pollution that's absorbed, the better. I, I don't know how much they absorb, though. I don't know if it's too substantial or not. Okay, this seems to be doing well enough. Doing on ammo. You guys are doing all pretty well. Can't get through. Guys are doing fine as well. There doesn't seem to be too much coming down the pipeline here, so good with that. Checking to make sure all these guys are working. It doesn't seem like a lot is coming down the line here. I'm not sure exactly if this is good or not. 
I'm assuming it's because it's they're going such a long way. There's a lot of pipes that they're being split across. That that's why the number is low. Um, I'm hoping that's the reason. I forgot to pick up the grenades, so we're gonna go back for the grenades. Oh. We'll go fight some biters. Yeah, yeah, but that's not exactly how fluid works in this game. Fluid's weird, man. Is that ammo again? I thought I gave this a lot of ammo. Okay, we're, we moved in a little bit. Uh, we might want to actually keep it here because it seems like this they are targeting it here um, and they're getting confused and then they just stay there and die. So I'm going to put another one down where that one was and we're going to make this a little bit more robust on this end because it doesn't look like anything is actually coming up towards here. So. We just want to make sure all these turrets can aim up that direction. All right, this this far at least. Okay, so we have our armor after that, and then let's head out. I'm gonna queue up some solar panels and while we're fighting so we're not wasting time gotta get that ABC going uh what am I looking for grenades ready then looks like you guys need the ammo The ones in the back line are a little bit safer, so I don't feel as wary um, putting more ammo in them because I don't think they'll die. They do seem to be coming around a little bit more, so I'm going to put another set of... We can spare the ammo. It is time to go. Let's get our extra inventory space and let's head out. Make our stable save here. And let's see what we want to tackle first. We want to get rid of these guys first. Um, this iron ore is pretty good. We might want to actually grab that now and bring it over to our smelting area. This right side is getting a little bit more scary. Seems like we're handling it pretty well here, but I think it'll, there'll come a time where that's not going to be good enough. So we're going to handle these bases first because these are the ones most likely to head to our oil base. And we want to just make sure nothing heads down there because that's they're not prepared. And they're too far away for us to keep going down there for maintenance. That is a large cohort of biters. I'm going to try to cut them off. Save us some trouble in base.
These big biters are a real headache. Do so much damage. Do I have any? I don't have any armor piercing with me. That sucks. Now I just saved, but now we're out here. Let's save again. Okay, this base doesn't look too bad. But it's not easy either. Yeah. <laughs> the the worms are a big issue here. Grab these guys. Oh my goodness. That is some crazy damage. Really need to not get hit at all. Want to survive this? There are any spitters? Why can't you just be biters? Alright. Looks like we survived, but this big worm is really causing us some issues. Unfortunately, we can't save any grenades trying to kill this guy. We have to use all of them. We say we survived that. Let's save. Go on to the next base. We're going to tackle these guys. Unfortunately, there's a lot of worms here too. Um, we're going to try to put down a wall down. Just a little bit of cover. I think we'll need. Doesn't exactly help us too much, but it helps us a little bit. That's all I can ask for at this point. Really just need to aggro all the big biters right away, kill them off, and then move in for the kill on the base because we can't really afford to have too many of them on us at any time. Get rid of them first before more spawn. We've already used up 200 grenades. Getting a little intense. I would like to move, please. Move towards our turrets. Hopefully they can help us weather the storm here. Our new shotgun. Why can't you be better? <laughs> I'm assuming the combat shotgun is amazing. Probably the same thing without the slow. Trying to move in, doing as much damage as we can before we head out. Yeah, let's... Thanks. Really hate these guys. I would appreciate if you died. And not me. Okay, well... We'll leave that base for another time. Let's try and tackle some of the smaller bases around here, hopefully. This looks doable. Unfortunately, we have to kill some trees, but it's okay. There's not so many things on us now, so I can or to get a little bit lower, but not that low, I guess. Thanks. The slows are just too much. 
I'm not really sure what we can do here. Um, other than keep on doing what we've been doing. I mean, what we're doing works. It just... We have to be a little bit more patient and use up more resources, but I do not like doing that. Especially using up all the fish that we're, that we're using up. Um, fish do not respawn, as far as I know. We are using a finite resource on the map. Uh, technically, I mean, I guess you could always find more water, but... This is crazy! Please let me go. Thank you. The medium biters are actually really annoying. <laughs> I think I killed myself there. No. Uh, I was hoping that this armor would help us, but looks like without any of the modules, um, it's not good enough for tackling these bases. I can't get rid of the worms right away. Oh, we died. <laughs> I'll try a couple more times. Um, I, I do think it's important to get rid of these guys if we can. Our current strategy is <laughs> to run around, hopefully they group up and then kill them that way, but that's not working out. All right, we're going to try the, the turret method. I'm not sure how well this is going to work, but it has to do something, right? Look at that. Practically worthless. And the bases don't die as quickly as anymore either. I threw like three grenades in there and they only have their like 60%. Uh, um, hmm. Alright, I say we're not doing this anymore so let's go back i don't think we're in a bad position overall i just think we can't handle the bases um we just need to go down our tech tree and build better stuff once we get energy shields this game becomes a lot easier uh but we need to get there first so let's do that we are definitely not in the same position we were last time. We're much better off, but... I, I was hoping we'd be even better off than we are now, which is unfortunate. Because, you know, as you can see, um, even with the big biters around, we're not losing too many turrets yet. So I'm still pretty hopeful there. We got that oil back up and running, and plastics. Things are looking up. We're really getting to that mid-game timing. And although we're not able to overpower those bases that much anymore, we're, we're doing fine on defense. So, seems good so far. Let's see how it plays out. We got some videos on your screen right now, if you'd like to watch them. Otherwise, thanks everyone for watching. I'll see you next time.